is the street level narratives of the Marvel Universe. There is the cosmic level, which Thor and Guardians and the Avengers have taken us to. But there is a very important supernatural side. Doctor Strange is our perfect entry point into that. And the fact that Benedict Cumberbatch has agreed to do this role is huge for us. His transformation into Strange is really extraordinary. He just automatically displays such fierce intelligence. It seems to have slipped into that character really easily and nicely. It is strange in a way, I suppose, no pun intended, that he's flown under the radar until now within the Marvel Cinematic Universe because he is a very big presence in the comics. So I think what we've seen happen within the Marvel Universe is this ever-expanding coterie of superheroes. And I think now we're at the stage where this universe, even within our world, is just about to explode into other dimensions. And I think Strange is a very natural bridge between what we know of perceivable reality and something well beyond that. and time travel and deconstruction and reconstruction. I think that's really exciting. I think audiences are always ready to take that ride. Usiamo la dimensione specchio per addestrare, sorvegliare e a volte contenere minacce. You look at the cast of Doctor Strange led by Benedict Cumberbatch and it is an embarrassment of riches. Benedict has got the brains and the wit to know how to play Doctor Strange. E tu sei Wong, solo Wong, tipo Adele. It's utterly inspiring, the cast of this film. I play Christine Palmer, an ER trauma doctor. Stephen and Christine were involved in this relationship. And then as his life starts to fall apart, the relationship becomes much, much more strained. Hai detto che perdere le mani non doveva essere la fine e poteva essere un inizio. Ci sono altri modi per salvare vite. Being able to work with all those amazing actors just raises the stakes. I mean, Tilda looks incredible as the ancient one. She deals in magic, in real, proper, in a magic. Attraverso le arti mistiche, imbrigliamo l'energia e plasmiamo la realtà. Basta solo concentrarsi. My character is the intro to Doctor Strange entering this, this universe. C'è una forza in lui. Non sei pronto per quello. Benedict Wong, I've made a few films with now, and it's weird having two Benedicts in a movie. Wong's involved in the training of young disciples. Se un volume della collezione dovesse essere rubato di nuovo, saresti morto prima di lasciare il complesso. Se lo restituissi in ritardo, dovrò pagare una penale. E se io ti dicessi che la realtà che conosci è una delle tante? Doctor Strange represents an entirely new aspect to the cinematic universe. Just like in the comics, Doctor Strange deals with parallel dimensions, deals with the multiverse. The comics are very, very out there, and we've pushed it with how we film this. For movies like this, IMAX is more immersive. Every set piece is an attempt to give audiences visuals and sequences in ways that we haven't seen them done before. Apre il suo occhio. Steve Ditko is one of the greatest Marvel artists in history, and that we're now able to take what he put in the mid-60s, these trippy comic panels and comic covers, and we now have the technology to put that into big three-dimensional space on a movie screen is amazing, and we're not pulling back. Vieni con me, Doctor Strange. Doctor Strange, il tuo lavoro ha salvato migliaia di vite. E se ti dicessi che quella realtà è una delle tante? Strange is incredibly arrogant, brilliant, sort of extraordinary, and his need to control fate, to control destiny, and in particular death, has brought him to the height of his profession as a neurosurgeon. He has a car crash and he loses the use of his hands and he spends all his money having operations to have his hands put back together and they don't work. He has quite a journey as his life starts to fall apart. He spends his last pennies on a ticket and goes to Nepal. He's searching for a cure for his hands and the issues that he's having. My character introduces him to this different, very mystical world. 
he finds the ancient one who is the sorcerer supreme. Ti domandi cosa vedo nel tuo futuro? Possibilità. Brings out this spiritual dimension which he never knew was possible. And he soon realizes the potential of someone who can help on a grander scale than he'd ever imagined actually existed. We're excited about the villains in this film. These are people who become seduced by what they find on the other side. Morirai proteggendo il tuo mondo. They are interested in spilling the barriers between these dimensions, which would annihilate our entire universe. Non posso farlo. Non c'è un altro modo. There's a lot of real world live action in this film. There's a lot of drama, a lot of comedy, but there's also the most extraordinary, fantastical adventure. I think it's going to be a great cinematic ride.